Let me show you how we can add a backdrop to our Google Drawing document. By default, we got this checkerboard. Checkerboard indicates transparency, so there's nothing here. And if we save our drawing as PNG, we'll have a transparent backdrop. What if you need a certain color or an image as your backdrop? Then you need to insert that image. So we're going to head to Insert Image, or you can use this image icon here insert image and simply load the image stretch it around and use it as your backdrop how about the color how we can fill this with a solid color or gradient in that case you will click here on shapes and we can use a regular rectangle as our backdrop here it is this rectangle we don't need any line around so transparent line and now we can select any color we need keep in mind we can click this little plus to generate more custom colors or you can even use a gradient let's make a custom gradient and here it is now you simply need to stretch this to cover your whole page And that's it. This will work as our backdrop. And now we can draw elements on the top of that, right? So we can put elements at the top. We can add a text here. And if for some reason something kind of go below your backdrop, you can always click on the backdrop, go to arrange and be sure that you put send it to the back. In my case, it's already at the back, so it's gray out. All right, so that's how easy it is to add a color or a gradient to your backdrop. Simply draw a container for that color, a rectangle, put the color in, and you are done. I hope this short tutorial was helpful, and I will see you in the next video.